It's always the time of conflict when countries are pushed to the edges of innovation. After all, everyone wants to outpower and outmaneuver their enemies in the most efficient way possible. As a result, we get to see some mind-blowing military vehicles that have the power to wipe out entire nations. From crazy submarines to bizarre tanks, here's hoping we don't have to see these machines used in real life. Number 12. Loon Class Acranoplan This machine isn't called the Caspian Sea Monster without good reason. Designed by the Russian Navy in 1975, the Loon Class Acranoplan is a colossal aquatic beast that looks more at home in the deep than above the waves. Originally, this machine was built to transport military equipment and soldiers super quickly over the water surface. It could carry around 100 tons of cargo one attempt, and the best part was, it could do so at lightning speed. The Loon Class Acranoplan was also designed as an anti-ship missile launch platform, with the ability to reach enemy ships as efficiently as an aircraft. It could even remain below the radar and behind the horizon throughout all its missions. Number 11. Lark LX A welded steel-hulled cargo vehicle that is sure to leave anyone jaw-dropped with its impressive size. Here is the Lark LX, the US military's largest amphibious craft. It comes in three unique sizes, ranging from 5-ton Lark V to Lark LX, capable of transporting 60 tons from the ocean to inland. It's pretty much the only amphibian in the current inventory that can enter and exit the shore through breaking surf. This machine can go just about anywhere and carry anything you can imagine fitting it in its spacious cargo bay. The Lark LX is equipped with four Detroit diesel engines, twin props, and a four-wheel drive to two to four-wheel steering. Number 10. Panzer 8 Mouse The Germans thought it would be amusing to name this impeccable vehicle after a mouse, when in reality it looks nothing like a tiny rodent. The Panzer 8 Mouse was one of the most enigmatic fighting vehicles of the Second World War. Weighing a remarkable 100 metric tons, the mouse holds the record as the heaviest fully enclosed armored fighting vehicle ever constructed. It is 33 feet and 6 inches in length, while its width is up to 12 feet and 2 inches. This machine can carry up to 6 crew members and has an expected operational range of 99 miles on road and 39 miles off road. Its speed can reach up to 12 miles per hour. Number 9. FCM Char 2C A World War I breakthrough tank project, the stunning French Char 2C remains the only super heavy tank produced in series and used operationally in any army. It was also the heaviest tank ever built until the arrival of the German Tiger II in 1944, weighing up to 69 tons fully loaded. The Char 2C is a powerful 5-seater behemoth tank armored with a variety of mountain weapons. It might be a bit slow, cumbersome, and lack proper anti-aircraft abilities, but the power of the tank makes up for everything else. The heavy armor and health ensures that the tank is tough to destroy one-on-one. -on -one. The driver has access to the main gun and can take out other tanks in one or two hits, depending on the enemy's land vehicle. Number 8. RT-23 Molodets This giant missile is a creation of none other than Russia. The RT-23 was cold-launched and came in silo and railway car-based variants. It was a three-stage missile that used solid fuel and thrust vectoring for the first stage, with 10 MIVR warheads, each with a 550 KT yield. Until the breakup of the Soviet Union, the strategic missile troops of Russia were the only operators of this mighty machine. A typical set of missile launch trains were composed of three M62 class locomotives, followed by generating power car, command car, support car, and three missile launch vehicles with a 9-car train seat. Number 7. Zuber Built by Alma Shipbuilding in St. Petersburg, the Zuber-class air cushion landing craft has been in service with the Russian Navy since 1988, and it's a machine the enemy should definitely watch out for. Zuber-class has a unique design, with the square-shaped pontoon structure of the hull providing a rugged and stable design. Two longitudinal bulkheads divide the pontoon superstructure into three functional sections. The middle section accommodates the compartments for armored vehicles to be landed with taxi tracks and loading and unloading ramps, while the two outer units house the main and auxiliary power plants, the troop compartments, crew living quarters, life support, and NBC protection. Number 6. Tupolev 2160 This beast right here is the largest and heaviest Mach 2 Plus supersonic military aircraft ever built. 
next to the experimental XB70 Valkyrie in overall length. The Tupolev Tu-160 is a variable sweep wing strategic bomber. The manufacturers designed the Tu-160 as White Swan due to its maneuverability and anti-flash white. It was built with the intent to deliver nuclear and conventional weapons deep in continental theaters of operation, and has proven to be pretty successful in its purpose. The Tu-160 uses fly-by wire controls and is equipped with three strut landing gear a tailwheel, and a brake parachute. The aircraft has a top speed of 1,367 miles per hour and a range of 7,642 miles. Number 5. Pyotr Veliki Pyotr Veliki is the fourth Kirov-class battlecruiser of the Russian Navy and is the one battlecruiser that rules them all. It was initially named Yuri Antropov after the former General Secretary of the Communist Party. However, the name was changed after the demise of the Soviet Union. Russians refer to this machine as a heavy nuclear missile cruiser, but Western defense commentators have repeatedly used the term battle cruiser to describe it. After all, it is the largest surface combatant warship in the world. It has a length of 827 feet and a width of 750 feet, with a total displacement of 24,300 tons. Moreover, the Pryotr Veliki has an incredible range of 1,000 nautical miles. Number 4. Akula If there's one submarine that couldn't be ignored on this list, it's the Akula, a series of nuclear-powered attack submarines first deployed by the Soviet Navy in 1986. The Akula-class submarines are 7,500 ton, 366 foot vessels that are enough to blow anyone away with their great size and strength. Several Akula-class submarines are dispatched in the Pacific region. The submarine has a double huffed configuration, with the hull having seven compartments. The standoff distance between the outer and inner holes is considerable, ensuring minimum internal hull damage. Incremental design improvements have achieved low acoustic signature reducing noise generation and transmission. The retractable mast viewed from bow to stern are the periscopes, radar antennae, radio and satellite communications, and navigation masts. Number 3. Yamato If the Akula class of submarines wasn't enough to impress you, check out the Japanese battleship Yamato. No other battleship has managed to become a cultural icon the way Imperial Japanese Navy's Yamato has. Displacing 72,000 long tons at full load, this battleship was the heaviest ever constructed. The class carried the most significant naval artillery ever fitted to a warship, nine 18.1 inch naval guns, each capable of firing 3,220 pound shells over 26 miles. It had primary armaments consisting of three triple mounted 45 caliber type 94 naval guns. Yamato could simultaneously engage multiple enemy battleships thanks to the heavy armor plating provided by an unparalleled degree of protection in surface combat. Number 2. USS General R. Ford Named after the 38th President of the United States, General Ford, this is a class of nuclear-powered aircraft carriers currently used by the U.S. Navy. It has a stunning design with advanced arresting gear, automation allowing a crew of several hundred, and the updated RAM-162 Evolved Sea Sparrow missile. It also features an electromagnetic aircraft launch system in place of traditional steam catapults for launching aircraft, a new nuclear reactor design, the A1B reactor for more significant power generation, and fantastic stealth features to reduce radar cross-section. This machine can carry up to 90 aircraft, including the Boeing Super Hornet and the Grumman C2 Greyhound. It has a length of 1,106 feet, a height of 250 feet, and a top speed of 35 miles per hour. Number 1. SAR tank. Also known as Lebedenko tank, or Netopir, this one might be one of the wackiest armored fighting vehicles in history. In fact, it seems to be taken right out of a science fiction novel or steampunk nightmare than something that existed in real life. Built by Russia in 1914, the SAR tank's huge wheels were the solution to the problem of passing over rough terrains and other obstacles. A set of rear wheels stabilized the tank, while a 250 horsepower engine powered the front wheels each of them effortlessly tackled any hindrance in the way. The hull resembled a tuning fork, at the center of which a large structure was added, containing a top turret. This held the crew's ammunition and armaments, most likely a myriad of cannons and machine guns. 
It's no surprise you had to dismount the vehicle into several parts just to transform it from one place to another. Alright, comment below which of these massive machines blew your mind the most. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe to TechJoint, and we'll see you in the next one.